Today we're going to be showing you how to properly configure your clipping light. The first step is to set the LPF at 100 to 125 Hz. Now set the subsonic filter at 30 to 35 Hz. Now set the master slave switch to master. Next set the amp gain to minimum. Now set the clipping light control halfway up. Next set all bass controls and EQ settings to zero. While playing one of your favorite tunes via the source used most commonly, set the head unit volume to 3 quarters. Slowly raise the gain on the amp until the clipping light starts to flicker. Now slowly turn the gain back until the clipping light stops flickering. Your clipping light should now be properly configured and flicker whenever your amp is clipping. So there you have it. With a little initial setup and some attention paid to the system while listening, you'll have many years of clean, enjoyable bass in your future. Make sure to tune in next month for tips on crossover optimization.